What's up guys? So today I've got a message for you people who claim to have anxiety and depression. I can cure it for you right here if you listen to what I say. Okay? You need to go out and exercise. That is it. You need to do the things that that part in your brain tells you to do, you know, your conscience. That's going to cure it. You need to do the things that you think about doing but never do. That's it. That's where these feelings come from. Because there's a part of your body that knows the truth and that knows what's right and what's good. And you ignore it. You ignore it and sit and watch TV and claim you don't have time. You ignore it and stuff your face with shitty food and then, oh, I feel shit. Ugh, shock. Fucking hell. You ignore it in every way possible. And then you think, oh my god, poor me, I feel shit. See, when you start living correctly, you don't feel shit. Because you can look at yourself in the mirror and know, yeah, okay, I'm not everything I could be, but I try every day. And that's when you don't feel shit about yourself. There's a reason you feel shit about yourself, because you are shit. You're acting shitty. Your body knows. Because you know yourself better than anyone else. And that's why you can have all your friends around you all day going, oh, you're perfect, hon. Don't change, you're just perfect the way you are. And you don't believe it. Because you know. Okay? So, then really it all comes down to the fact that you don't really feel that anxious and that depressed because you know what see when i felt that anxious and that depressed it was so bad that i was like fuck this something needs to change and i changed my life so you can quit your fucking moaning because really all it seems that you want is special treatment you don't want to go out there i've told many people how to fucking fix their anxiety because i've been there and i fixed it myself i've told them given them the tools do they do it no they just want the world to bend around them so that they can Oh, oh, I'm special and, and I, have, I have problems. Give me attention because I'm just, oh. No, it's not the way the world works. And guess what, you don't feel any better, so ha ha. You know? The world shouldn't be bending around you. If you've got a problem, you have to fix it. That is really, it's that simple. And it shows as well that you, I mean, look at all these people who, you know, the excuse was I don't have time. And then we have lockdown, you fucking, you're in your house for months. And you don't do anything, you haven't learned anything new and then you're telling me it's not fair that you haven't been given everything that's why you're begging for special treatment off of people and pity and playing the fucking victim olympics because that's the only way you can be seen as special because you don't do anything you're never you actually know that no one's going to see you as special because you're not I hope that hurts you, I actually I'm not trying to hurt people but the people they need to hear this should be hurt. They should be that hurt that they go, fuck, you're right, that's why I'm hurt and I'm gonna not be that anymore because that's disgusting. That's what you need to feel. And it seems that I have a very sensitive disgust reflex. That's a great thing because then I know when to be disgusted at myself. And all you other fuckers, not all of you, obviously the cool people out there agree with me <laughs> and are disgusted with things in the world and themselves as well. You know, you have to, you can't just judge the world and not yourself. I judge the world and myself. I'm disgusted with myself a lot and, and I have been a lot in the past. So that I can be good. You need both sides. Okay? You can't all just be good. You can't just say, oh, the world's so bad and look at all these people judging and then you don't judge yourself. But then you're the ones that feel shit. You know, you feel shit within yourself because you know you're not honest and you're not true. And that's why you have anxiety and that's why you have depression. But they're not going to tell you that when you go and visit the doctor. They're just going to give you pills so you come back and you pay them money. They're not going to give you the truth, are they? Because no one wants the truth. That's why we have fucking medication. But take me as your fucking doctor. That's a lot better. But no, a lot of you are just going to go away and not listen to me. That's fine. You don't deserve my help anyway. But for those of you that it touches, fucking listen up and change your life. Because I tell you something when you're honest and you change your life and finally you're able to look at yourself in the mirror. What a weight it is off your shoulders. To go to sleep at night and not feel like a piece of shit and not be worried and confused. Confused? I used to be so confused all the time. Because you don't know how... 
because you're not honest, because you, you don't know how to speak to anyone, or what does this person think, and you worry all the time, what does this person think of me? Who gives a fuck? See, as I said yesterday, fuck being nice. What a weight off your shoulders. I don't care, because I know I'm good. So you can say whatever the fuck you want about me. It doesn't matter. But I know that bothers you. Because you care what people think. Because you don't know that you're good all by yourself. Well, I know I am, so there we go. That is the run over. That was my running thoughts. To those of you who are like me, I really appreciate you. Um, and to those of you who this does touch, I hope this helps because you need to be told the truth. You don't need to be told that, oh, let's just do some... F oh, I mean, honestly, the mental health profession. That's what I want to go into, by the way, because I'm interested in this stuff. But then it's like, I'm not fucking peddling the shite that they want. As in, oh, you're just great and let's just talk about things and, and here's some pills. No. Because I know that's not how you fix someone. You fix someone... Well, I can't fix anyone. No one can fix anyone. All I can do is offer the truth. And the ones who are willing to fix and change themselves, they will do that. And they will help themselves. You can't help people as such, you know? It's, it's everyone's choice whether they want to help themselves. So, okay, that's it. Make good choices, not bad excuses.